My name is Sean Askinosi, and I am the founder and CEO at Askinosi Chocolate. And have I ever had a day that I'm ready to quit? And the quick answer to that is yes. I've had a lot of days. When I started this company, there were many, many, many days in the beginning where I felt like quitting because I couldn't figure out how to make chocolate. And I'd already quit my law practice, so that was a little tiny problem there, not being able to figure it out for months. I had a payroll, I'd put my life savings into this place, and uh, yeah, I had days that I was ready to quit. And I've been doing this now for 10 years. I still have days that I'm ready to quit. And, but here's the weird thing. Those are very challenging days, but in a very sick sort of way, I like those days. Now, the entrepreneurs who are watching this will totally understand what I'm talking about. Because those challenges are almost the lifeblood of entrepreneurship. It's what, it's, those challenges are what make it in this crazy way kind of worth it. Because it's like math, you know? I mean, those people who like math, I'm not one of them, but you really have this sense of accomplishment when you finish this really complicated math problem, you know, and, and you worked your way through it. And I think that's the feeling that I have when I've kind of worked my way through this really challenging problem that's not just one day, but it may be protracted for days and weeks and months. But it's, it's, it's the fun of entrepreneurship. But yes, I've, I've, had, I've had days that I'm ready to quit. And I think that there's a couple of things that get me through besides just sort of the notion that entrepreneurship is challenging, but yet rewarding and fun. Um, and that is, over the years, I've tried to learn and to practice not being attached to this. That is, this is a nice building. We've worked hard on it. But this is not all there is. And I don't want to hold my grip so tightly onto this chocolate factory, into this business, that it's all I have and that it's all that I am. And it's a practice. It's a daily practice. And so I want to have this idea that I'm ready to let go of it at any moment. I'm going to hold on. I'm going to do my best. I'm going to work hard. I'm going to survive. I'm going to push. I'm going to answer the call. But I want to, at the same time, be ready to let it go. And that is a balance. And I, I want to be ready for that. Part of that has to do with my faith. The other part of it has to do with um, the, the, the fact that this is not my identity. Chocolate maker is not my identity.